conflict so far. And I wanted to ask you, looking forward, maybe placing political goals aside where possible, what are Russia's military goals and what are the chances that the Ukrainian forces can stop Russia from achieving them? Is it possible or plausible that the Ukrainians could simply exhaust the Russian forces? Yeah, sure. It's, it's a great question. So first, actually, we should ask something else. What are the political goals? The political goals, in my view, of, of regime change and whatnot in Ukraine now are unachievable for Russia. I'm already, already seeing them trying to revise their war aims and likely they're going to have to accept something quite short of what they initially wanted as they went into this war, some kind of settlement uh, with Ukrainian leadership. Now, can they still achieve you know, a military victory? Yeah, of course. War is highly contingent. Russia can win, Ukrainian forces can exhaust them. Uh, a lot of it's not predictable. And I was saying, look, analysis is not fortune telling. You should be very careful peering into a crystal ball to make pronouncements of what's going to happen in the war. Wars can turn dramatically. I'd say that the Russian military, as it stands, has a chance of achieving military objectives, but much more slowly and much higher costs than they or the political leadership wanted. Those may not at all amount to achieving desired political ends, which is the real issue, right? Because wars are fought to achieve political objectives, not just to achieve battlefield victories. On the sort of Ukrainian side of the story, you know, their morale continues to hold. They put up pretty fierce resistance. I think they're fighting fairly smartly. Can they exhaust the Russian military over time? Yep, absolutely. They are pretty effectively trading uh, territory. They're trading space to buy time. And... Within the coming weeks, the Russian military could find significant parts of the formations they've sent in combat ineffective, exhausted, and at the very least, they'll need you know major operational pause to regroup, resupply, reorganize. So I do, I do think, and I do suspect that uh, a, at least the initial phase of this war can't go on sustainably, and I definitely see a way in which, well, the Ukrainian military, if not, <laughs> if not that it could win outright. Um, can certainly win from a big picture perspective, right? And then there's all these areas that, that Russian forces have taken that they don't really have the manpower to control. And over time, a substantial partisan movement or insurgency could make it too costly for them to to manage the parts of the country that, that they have seized 